Joe Alessi, Dick Nash, Bart van Leer. Ridiculous high players. What do they have in common? Funnily enough, they all started to learn brass instruments with the trumpet. This is an out-of-the-box high-register hack. But if you're really interested in improving the focus of your embouchure, I'd recommend buying perhaps a cheap used trumpet and learning it. So it's clear to see the difference in the size of the mouthpieces. The trumpet size simply forces a lot of lip into a much smaller surface area, thus creating a more efficient embouchure, more likely, in the high register. This can have spectacular and quick results for your trombone playing. I personally had to learn trumpet for teaching reasons, and it did help in a very interesting way. <laughs> course we need to be careful with the sound that we're not spending too much time there and neglecting the trombone hit subscribe please if you're getting value from these videos i really appreciate it i'm serious tap it now you say you're supporting the trombone community hit subscribe so consider doing this think of it like an athlete having to work under more difficult climatic conditions in heat in high altitude. It's a kind of athletic training and an out of the box solution that could work wonders. For little money, I'm sure you'll find a used instrument. This, by the way, a useful tip perhaps, this is a cornet. I never really liked the resistance, the high resistance of the trumpets I played and found this cornet to be much easier blown. This is a CR300 Bach, the student model, works really well and sounds pretty cool. There's also, of course, companies like Besson making cornets. Check it out and let us know how you got along. If you're enjoying this, hit subscribe, please. Support a trombone player. Appreciate it and see you next time.